Today we will talk about Next Generation Squad Weapon, NGSW, program. NGSW is a United States military program started in 2017. It aims to replace the M4 carbine and M249 LMG and to develop 6.8mm cartridges and small arms fire control systems for the new weapons. The program's rifle requirement is referred to as NGSWR, you can also consider it as an assault rifle or battle rifle. The support weapon or automatic rifle is referred to as NGSWAR, you can also consider it as a light machine gun or squad automatic weapon. Weapon specification required to be no longer than 35 inch. Not heavier than 12 pounds or 5.4 kilograms including attachments. Capable of firing a common 6.8 mm U.S. Army designed projectile. Capable of hitting targets up to 1,200 meters and firing accurately at targets up to 610 meters. And able to use small arms fire control systems. Fire control system specifications required number of advanced technologies, including a variable magnification optic, from 1 to 8. Backup etched reticle. Laser rangefinder. Ballistic calculator. Atmospheric sensor suite. Compass. Intrasoldier wireless. Visible and infrared aiming lasers. And a digital display overlay. A total of seven defense manufacturers competed in the program. Five companies attempted to design and manufacture weapons and ammunition. Two companies attempted to design and manufacture fire control optics. Seiji Sauer offered its SIG MCX spear rifle and SIG MG 6.8 bell-fed machine gun with custom 6.8 by 51 SIG Fury brass steel hybrid cartridges. General Dynamics offered its RM277R rifle and RM277AR machine gun with .277 TVCM polymer-cased cartridges of true velocity. PCP Tactical offered its Desert Tech MDR rifle and machine gun with 6.8mm polymer case metal cartridges of PCP ammunition. FN America offered its HMR rifle and Evil East machine gun with Federal Cartridge Company cartridges. Textron Systems offered its Textron CT system rifle and LSAT light machine gun with Olin Winchester CT 6.8mm polymer cased telescoped cartridges. Vortex Optics and L3 Harris Technologies offered next-generation small arms fire control systems for new weapons. Only five companies made it to the final evaluation. Cyg Sauer, General Dynamics, Textron Systems, Vortex Optics, and L3 Harris. On April 19, 2022, after 27 months of prototyping and evaluation, the Army awarded SIG Sauer to produce the XM-5 rifle and XM-250 squad automatic weapon. Vortex Optics to produce the XM-157 fire control system. And Winchester to produce the 6.8x51mm cartridge, designed by SIG Sauer. During evaluation, more than 1,000 soldiers, hundreds of Marines, and Special Operations Force tested and evaluated the rifle and automatic rifle prototypes. Some possible reasons are SIG rifles are more compact as compared to the other two competitors, because SIG rifles feature foldable buttstock. General Dynamic Rifle has a reciprocating barrel to reduce recoil, which also decreases accuracy but the rifle still generates more recoil as compared to other competitors. SIG rifles are lightweight and more reliable due to their simple design, whereas Textron and General Dynamic Rifle mechanisms are more complex. SIG rifle design has similar configurations and ergonomics to existing rifle platforms. Compared to other competitors, General Dynamic did not have a bell-fed machine gun. In modern-day warfare, belt-fed machine guns are more effective. Comparing Textron and SIG machine gun, SIG machine gun has low recoil because it uses a reciprocating barrel. You have to understand that accuracy is more important in a rifle not in a machine gun. The SIG XM5 will replace the M4 carbine in the infantry, scouts, and combat engineer communities. The M4 will continue to be used by general-purpose forces, 
essentially all other soldiers in the army for the coming decades. SIG XM250 will replace the M249. The NGSW is the Army's solution to the range, accuracy, and lethality problems in small arms for the close combat force.